next guest is Johnny Versace on American Crime Story. And from HBO, he was the cop who was trying to undo what Hugh Grant did on The Undoing. Now he teams with Jennifer Garner for the new movie, Yes Day. It's on Netflix now. Please welcome Edgar Ramirez. <laughs> Very well, very well, very happy. Oh my God, people! You were great on you were great on the Undoing, by the way. I Thank enjoyed you. your work on that show. Thank really, you very much. It really was. How have you been? What have you, where have you been during this uh, COVID time? Well, the the first the first part I was here in LA. Mm -hmm. you no, know, um, hunkering down here, and then and then for Christmas I went to my friend's house, which is you know got this beautiful house in the Rocky Mountains. I've been crossing. You know, oh. going across the Rocky Mountains. During... Had you been there before, the Rocky no, Mountains? No, never, never. And yeah. then I, I, I was supposed to be, I was supposed to stay for a week, and it's been three months. So. Oh, you were three yeah, months in the Rocky yeah. Mountains. Yeah, I'm, I'm still there actually. I, I'm, I'm going back. Did they invite you to stay for three months? No, no, just... no. That's why. Be I mean, if, if you ever invite me, be careful. <laughs> be careful if you invite me over because I might stay. I mean, I'm, I'm, I'm squatting on this, on this guy. Wow. Yeah. So what's the arrangement? How many people in the house? We were, we were for. For, for, for New Year's, we were five, and okay. now it's three. It's almost like, a, like the worst reality show that you can imagine. Because uh -huh. it's, like, <laughs> it's, it's, yeah, because we started, we, we started five, and then two left, and then three stayed. And it's been, it's been you know, three guys. Everyone's Venezuelan oh. in the middle of the mountains with a lot of snow. So it's Caribbean people dealing with the elements of the snow. It's been... Oh, you've never it's, had to live no, in snow no, no. before. Yeah. Things like, for example, you know, you used to... I remember, you know, I mean, we, we, we saw, I mean, growing up, I saw snow on American movies, you know? Mm -hmm. So basically, basically it's like, you know, then it started to start to snow and you're looking out the window and oh, it's so beautiful. And cut to um, a month after, it's snow and it's like, get the car out of the driveway and put it on the road because it's gonna get stuck. I mean, it's like every day, yeah, it's an something adventure, every day. you know, like shoveling snow. The mud room, the mud room is the most important room. The mud room is the important, mountains, right. You know? I mean, in Venezuela, we have all type of rooms, but not a mud room. No mud here. rooms? Yeah. And here in LA, it's basically not a priority. How but... old were you the first time you saw snow? I think I was, I was 16. Oh, okay. All right. Yeah, I was 16. That's yeah. reasonable. Yeah. yeah. And are you guys like splitting up the duties of the house? Like, how's it working? Are you? Well, absolutely. Absolutely. You have to. I mean, we do everything. You know, it's been, again, it's like the worst reality show you can ever imagine. <laughs> so basically, um, I, I, I do the tidying or I try. You know, okay. like I have different boxes because it's a new house. So everything's been coming, you know, boxes, boxes. So I use the boxes, I reuse them to put, you to try to put like the beanies and the gloves and all the things that we need. Nobody listens, of course. Mm -hmm. Oh, really? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> then I had, I, and we're all from Venezuela. So uh, uh, then, <laughs> then this, other, this other friend who's the owner of the house is a great cook. His mother is from Spain. So he cooks everything with olive oil. Nice. So we basically run the house of, you know, the run, runs on propane. And olive oil. I mean, olive oil <laughs> is essential. And this other, this other friend, this other guy, he's actually he's the one that takes the he takes the cake. He's the one that cleans the bathrooms. Oh, that's the so most important guy. So he goes guy. Rambo style, you know, like the the, the the knife, you know, in his teeth. He has know. a knife. He go, yeah, he goes at it. I mean, what? you have to. I mean, three guys, <laughs> two bathrooms. You know, so you need. I mean, you need a certain personality. When to tackle it, that. you need a knife to clean the toilet, that's when you start to question the chef. <laughs> there you, go. you know, you really. And I really hope he's watching. You know, I really. I mean, I hope there's electricity today. You got to bring him some olive oil. He'll be happy. No, yeah. absolutely. I mean, if you don't. I mean, if you don't bring olive oil every time we go to the to the to the to the, to the nearest town, then you know, there's trouble. Uh, yeah. Yeah. Things go down. Oh yeah. yeah. This movie is, has an interesting premise. This is the idea of the movie is what? Tell us. It's about um, choosing one day in the not so distant future, where you say to your kids, yes to everything they want. Yeah, that is terrifying. <laughs> I always get that, but no, actually it's great because then the rules make more sense. And of course you have to set up some rules. I mean, it's not that, you know, uh, I mean, there's a geographical, you know, uh, law. You can't say, let's it. go to the moon. Yeah, right. exactly. Yeah. I mean, they, they would say things like that. Right. But it's not like that. And then it's not about the money. It's not about expanding. I mean, it's about, it's about creating activities where you just, 
help the 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 tension and um it's uh I think that there there are certain there are certain imbalances or tensions that that are created by the everyday's life so the yeah. yes day is just to ease all that I know and I think it's not only from for, from parents to children it's also in any relationship that is meaningful to you you can have a yes day I mean you could you could give we have a C day. Yes day. We we call it C day. We have a right? C day. I mean, you yeah. should, I mean, you should give each other a yes day. Okay. You know, right. think about it. Every day with Guillermo is a yes. Exactly. Day. Yes. So it yeah. is. Yeah. yeah. Even in my house, my wife tell me you got to do the laundry. Yes. 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 Yeah. <laughs> yeah. That's not how it works, Guillermo. Yeah. It's supposed to be something fun. What was the most like for you personally yeah. in the movie? The most. <laughs> what was the most fun yes thing? Uh, there were a lot, but uh, but but I would say it was the ice cream. The, the ice, ice cream. cream. Yeah. Eating as much ice cream. Yeah. Like one of those contests where you yeah. have to eat the whole deal. Yeah. Yeah. And there you are eating ice cream, dressed by your children. <laughs> how much ice cream did you actually you see, eat? You, you see how focused I am in that picture. You are very focused. Because I am a professional ice cream eater. I, I didn't know that. Oh, yeah, 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 since I was a kid. I mean, I've been practicing for, what, like 35 years? Do you think that's because huh? you never had snow? You were trying to fill some void? Hmm, <laughs> that's interesting. <laughs> you see, you're always, yeah, exactly. Uh, maybe, maybe. Maybe. How much maybe. ice cream did you eat that day? I ate a lot. I mean, I wouldn't, I wouldn't advise anyone to eat that amount, you know, that amount of ice cream, but, uh, but I'm a professional. I mean, I've been doing it. <laughs> As I said, for the last 35 years, so. You are... And it was a fantasy of mine when I, was, when I was a kid. I remember, I don't know if it was in Venezuela or in Colombia or maybe in both countries, there was this commercial of this little, this little kid. He was my age, maybe like six or five at the time. And, and he would come, you know, like dressed as an adult, you know, uh, to this fancy restaurant, you know, with all adults. Uh -huh. He would come to the table and then he would start to order ice cream and then, the, you know, the, the fancy kind of snide waiter would come, you know, and give him like the most spectacular ice cream bowl and he would eat it and then ask for more, eat it. And that stayed with me forever. Isn't Little that I funny? knew that I would fulfill my childhood's fantasy as an adult in yes days. And it's weird because it's a fantasy that really you could have had come true for $50. Absolutely. <laughs> but the thing is that you don't think about that. <laughs> right, and yeah. I, and, and yeah, I had to do it and it was all me. So it was no stunt double, nothing. It was me. I oh, you? Yeah. yeah. I know you've lived all over the world. What's the best ice cream experience you've ever had in your life? The best cone or sundae or whatever it was. What was it? Uh, that is that is hard to tell because I've been you know I've been very dedicated. To For me, it was this. gelato in huh? Italy the first time I went there, having it from the street. But that's the great thing about Italy. You have one every corner. Yes, I right. mean every corner you have a gelato, a gelateria, uh, an ice cream place, and it's fantastic. I remember one. I love ice cream with a lot of like chunky stuff, mm. you know? I mean, if it doesn't have it, then I, then, I, then I take a cookie and I just like, you know, like I, 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 I I'm understanding why your friend has the knife now. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you got me there. <laughs> I, yeah, I shouldn't have said that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> well, it's great to see you. The Thank movie you. is called Yes Day. Thank you You're so gonna much. be hearing a lot about it from your children. It's on Netflix now. Thank Edgar you. Ramirez, Thank everybody. You so Thank you, Thank Edgar. You. We'll be back with Two yeah. Yards. Congratulations on making it to the end of a YouTube video. Why not celebrate by clicking the subscribe button? You earned it.